So you probably don't need any weight for this exercise whatsoever. If you have got some small one or two kilo dumbbells around the house, then fine. You could also potentially use some tinned vegetables, tinned soup, for example, and that would also work. However, most people I've worked with and myself don't need to use any weight whatsoever, provided you do enough repetitions. The purpose of this exercise is to get as much tension in the upper back and shoulder external rotators as possible. And you're gonna hold that position that I'm gonna demonstrate in a moment for a period of around about two or three seconds until you feel as though you can no longer hold it anymore. It's very important that you're honest with yourselves and that you squeeze as hard as you physically can. Now you can do this standing up. I prefer to do it kneeling or sat down just because it's a little bit more comfortable and I can hold this position a little bit longer. On my knees, I'm gonna try and hinge at the hip by pushing my bottom backwards to maintain a nice neutral spine. From here, you're gonna position yourself into what looks like a, a W shape created by your arms. From here, you're going to initiate it by squeezing your shoulder blades together and then externally rotating as hard as you can at the shoulder. Now, personally, I can't do any more than about 20 reps before I have to stop. So I tend to do a number of sets following press-ups or chest exercises just to help alleviate any postural problems, but it's also a very, very good way to build and strengthen the posterior deltoid and the upper back.